Well, my name's Martin Lucas. I run a company called Casper Hope and Associates. It was part of Lucas Management, but now it runs separately. Um, we represent actors for television, film and commercial, predominantly. Uh, we don't chase extras, uh, promotions, that sort of work. Do I use the internet to run my agency? Absolutely, every day, probably every hour of the day. Yeah. Without it, it's, you know, it wouldn't have an agency, to be absolutely honest. Right. It's, it's reduced the number of face-to-face -face time of meeting people and, and couriering information across the town. Like, back when, well, more than 15 years ago, when we used to get a call sheet for something, it was delivered by bicycle. Now, I'm not that old, but that wasn't that long ago. Um, when people used to send in a brief, we used to receive a fax, we'd fax photos, or you'd put a bundle together and have to be couriered across town. Um, it's eliminated the need to be in a city all the time. So you can have your laptop sitting on the beach, which I've done, and work. And the internet's changed the industry in the fact that if the industry didn't embrace the internet, it would have been left behind. It's just, it, technology moves so fast that if you weren't on it, you'd forget it. And it's changed it because it's, it becomes faster and everyone's got more information, which is better. Casting people can make decisions quicker on whether they even want to, want to see somebody. So, um, therefore, the quality of material that the actors have to send have to be as good as they can possibly have. So with the internet, you can send an updated photo now. Like, you can take a picture today, and half an hour ago, and post it to someone, and it's there. Whereas, you go back, you just can't do that. You couldn't do that. How do I use AT2? I use it to mostly pitch people. Um, so once the actor's loaded up and a role comes in, a casting from Sydney or Melbourne, I just go to pitch, scroll through, because I don't have many people anyway, so it's fairly easy. And I attach those. But sometimes I would have gone, oh, yeah, that should be Shannon or that should be Taryn, uh, in my immediate thought. But I'll open the page and go, oh, that could be... Belinda. Could be. Maybe I'll put that up there. And I'll paste them all up. Then I'll have a look at it. And then I might even you know, edit that back a bit in colour. You know? And then I'll send that as my selection. Mm -hmm. Or I'll send a separate one and say, look, I'm not really sure, but here's an outside thought. And I'll send that as a separate pitch. Um, that's how I use it. I mean, but I've used it for all, all the time, so I find it really simple. How did I first start using AT2? It was fantastic because quite often you'd be sending photos and resumes via fax and quite often it was at the end of the day and I didn't have a girl or guy at the front counter saying will you send these so it was my job you know and sometimes if everyone's sending faxes I remember um, a job that was done a number of years ago and Brad talked about this uh, AT2 received three and a half thousand pieces of information to be sent to a job you know now that didn't just start to happen I guess the volume did but back when we were sending faxes, there were probably three or four hundred people trying to send the same fax. Mm -hmm. So you'd be there for hours trying to get through. And you don't have to, now. you go click, click, and you do it as the job comes in. And your day's free, it's done. It saves me an enormous amount of time, so therefore it would save me money. And it saves everyone else time because they can get an answer within five or ten minutes if, you know, if everyone's in line. If you're at home or at work at the office and you can send something. But I've sent, used ATT on my mobile. I'm in the middle of the shopping centre, and I go, do, 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 send. And they send back, yeah, I'll hear her, fantastic. Of course it saves you money, because you haven't got to rush back to an office somewhere, or back to a point where you can open something, and, and they've got an answer. The casting director's got information like, oh, yeah, that'd be great, I'll see her.